night of celebration marred by violence. New Year's kicks off with downtown businesses on edge. Two videos from outside the Jacksonville Landing go viral. The videos show JSO officers arresting people involved in two separate brawls. And with that video, negative comments about security at the landing and surrounding areas of downtown Jacksonville. The question now is what impact those videos may have on businesses at the landing. Channel 4's Eric Avanier joined us live from the Jacksonville Landing with reaction to those videos. Eric? Well, it was in the middle of the street where the first brawl involving multiple individuals uh, basically erupted. Then 40 minutes later, a second brawl erupts uh, right behind those bushes there. Fortunately, no one was seriously injured. However, there is discussion as to whether or not those videos that went viral may have, uh, shall I say, uh, hurt some of the businesses here at the landing. When you mix alcohol and adrenaline, things like this happen everywhere. I was actually very much impressed with the way JSO responded here at the landing. A response that was captured on cell phone video. Several people were tackled and arrested as police tried to break up a fight outside the landing on New Year's Eve. An hour before that skirmish, police quickly ran to break up another brawl. This incident was also outside the landing, and most of those involved ran off. Cell phone video captured the arrest of one of the suspects. Both of the videos quickly got a lot of attention on the News for Jack's Facebook page with negative comments about security concerns. The question now is whether these videos will keep people away from the landing. I think it could affect the people that aren't from Jacksonville, but it really doesn't bother the people that are here in Jacksonville because it's more of a normal thing around here. Well, it keeps some people from coming back. Probably, and what, you know, but like I said, the only thing that you possibly can do is just guarantee the safety, the best to your ability on what you could do. And I 100% seen JSO do that. One restaurant manager says the social media criticism of the landing is unfair. One incident out of how many, um, you know, days of the year, 365, you know, and, and one you know, little fight that happens outside, you know, the landing and everybody, nobody wants to come downtown anymore. You know, um, always unsafe. You know, all that stuff that you're talking about that was on, on social media. So it, it's just, it's, 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 it's a bad vibe. Now, at this point, we don't have an accurate number of the number of people who were actually arrested. However, we have put in a request to get that information from the sheriff's office. Reporting live from outside the, the Jacksonville Landing, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, the local station.